Hi, my name is Trevor Tysman with KBandTraining.com. Today we're going to work a soccer drill. It's going to be great for you defenders out there pushing your opponent to the sideline and really working on your hip rotations and explosiveness. Check out the drill set up here. We've got a, a drop of cones here about five to eight yards apart and we're going to sprint forward first. First part of the drill is we're going to take off forward. You're going to stop your opponent here. Once you hit the cone, you're going to drop your hip. You're going to take off a lot of knees. As soon as you get to this other cone, we're going to drop as if that or your opponent has made a move. You're going to block him here, and then you're going to take off again, hit the next cone, open up. You're always trying to keep your body in between you and the offensive player here. So you take it all the way down on this last cone. When you hit this last cone here, we're going to take off as if we've won the ball, and we're going to gain some ground. Before you start this drill, make sure you get the K-bands on. It's really going to help us open our hip and strengthen our legs for a little bit more of that leg drive and develop your speed. Great to cross train here, doing speed and agility training, as well as working on our soccer skills. So let's get started here. We got our resistance sets. A lot of knees, a lot of arms. Come on, be quick. Open up the hip, drop, 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 open up the hip and go. Good, be fast. Quick, 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 quick. Turn and go, turn it up, turn it up. We're here at the first cone and I wanted to point out some things to help with your footwork to help increase your speed, right? When that offensive player is coming at you, you've got to be able to drop and go. So the biggest thing here is you're going to drop your left foot here and he's turning his hips. Okay, when he turns his hips, you got to get this back leg through so you can really take off, right? You got to beat him to the next spot. When you get here, now if the offensive player makes a move, we've got to get opened up and body up, okay? So he opens up that foot, takes those quick strides, and again, it's all about his hips. So he opens up, drops, and goes. Remember, the most important part about being a good defender is getting your body in between you and the goal. So you've got to be quick, you've got to be able to move your hips and think to use the bands to your advantage. Drive your hips to help with those hip flexors, all right? Let's jump in, we got rep number two here. Get your body set up, remember a lot of arms and work those hips and really focus on really driving through and exaggerating this set, all right? Here we go, knees up, knees up, turn the hips and go, turn the hips and go, be quick, be quick. Very good, he drops, he drops, take it off. You won the ball, you won the ball, turn it up, turn it up. Good. All right, we've just moved through our two demo resisted sets. At home, you're gonna do your six to eight. Go ahead and unclip the bands. We're gonna go with our unresisted sets now. Now remember, these are great because now we've got full muscle stimulation. We're really ready to rock. We can now open up our hips with no resistance and it's time to focus on our foot speed, all right? So this is time that you really need to work. We got two to four unresisted sets. So six to eight resisted, two to four unresisted. Big drill here, you can get your teams running through nonstop, a lot of pace, a lot of reps. All right, let's get our unresisted in. Ready? Go. Come on, be quick, be quick. Come on, be faster now, be faster. You gotta be better. Push, push, open up, open up. Go, 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 go. Turn it up, turn it up. Remember, you've got six to eight resisted sets. Working for that hip strength, really working to exaggerate that knee drive. When you're resisted, you're conscious of your legs, you're conscious of your form, so it's gonna help you be more explosive if you power through the resistance. You're gonna follow that up with two to four unresisted sets. Now again, you've got full muscle stimulation. You're feeling lighter, you're feeling a little bit easier to open your hips, easier to be more explosive. Work to think of the attacker, all right? You have to get your body in between them and the goal. So be quick to each cone, open up the hips, drop and get to the next one. Don't be lazy on that last cone. As soon as you get there, picture yourself winning the ball and turn it up field. Anything you need, kbandtraining.com. We've got a lot more soccer drills there for you.